Hi everyone, it's Lil Boba. I'm setting up my phone and I'm live on the stream. Hello to the streamer that is watching me, all one of you. I don't really know who's looking at my Instagram live, but if you are watching, I'm designing my home. Okay. So let's let me show you what the inside is and then maybe we'll we'll get somewhere. Okay. So first of all, this is my living room, you know. I I feel like it's cluttered. It's obvious the things that I like, you know, I'm into music. I want this I want this little crystal set up to still be here, but we might make a separate room for all that, you know, a little manifestation room or something. Um, but yeah, it just needs to be a little bit more concise. I also would like maybe for this room to be my kitchen and then this other side room to be like a hangout room because I really do love all the kitchen items. So we'll see how that goes. Hi, Blair Crossing. Welcome. I'm also streaming live on Instagram. You guys on Instagram, if you don't know, I am streaming on Twitch. I think I have gotten it working, and I'm recording, so this will be up on my Twitch. Um, I just need some advice. We're about to do some home design, so let's just clear everything out, right? It seems like the most logical thing to do. Put everything away. You gotta start fresh. That's what all the YouTubers tell me, you know? Yeah music off even though it was kind of a vibe but we're gonna start with a new vibe today okay get rid of everything I just needed a refresh y'all you know the holiday season is here I wanted to shake it up Uh, let me know where you think I should start. Should I start with the floor? Should I start with the walls? You know, what? where should I start first after I clear everything out? Uh, I guess I gotta clear the walls too. Ooh. I always, I swear, I always forget the difference. Come on. All right, there we go. Do to do. See, I got Halloween decorations up and Halloween is over. I'm a whole mess. Ooh, we don't like that lighting. We like our lighting nice and warm. Nice and warm. I love home designing more than terraforming. I have trouble. I feel like I designed this like months ago. Like, probably the last time I did any major changes is for this wallpaper. That's the wedding wallpaper. And then I was just like, I'm done. I ran out of ideas. But, you know, I think this is a nice... I needed a, f a fresh, clean start, you know what I mean? Nice, clean slate. Floor, so that's the whole vibe. Okay, let's see. I really like this flooring. We can explore something else. Let's see what I've got. Blair Crossing is giving us the suggestions. Shout out to Chrissy from Skittles on the Instagram Live. I can't see the chat because I have so many screens open. I wish I had a holder for my phone. I'm just leaning it up against my laptop, but that's okay. All right, we're going to look at floors. Birch flooring, I think, is what I have right now. Yeah, I think that is what I have right now. I want to make it Christmassy, you know what I mean? I'm trying to give off, like, holiday cozy vibes. Maybe a, maybe a nice rosewood. Wait a minute, I did just get that. Thanksgiving flooring. Where's that at? Cause that that looks pretty classy. Where is it? 
Did I use it? Oh, I used it in the basement. We gotta go to the basement. Oh. Getting turned around in my own home. Check in the basement. Oh, this isn't it either. What the heck? Where is this flooring? I know I'm not crazy. Dark herring bone. Oh, turkey day, duh. I'm like looking for the word Thanksgiving as turkey day. Okay. We're moving right along. I do need to plug in my laptop or it will die. Oh, and that's not Gucci. Here we go. All right, we're back at it. We're gonna use the turkey day flooring, obviously. Don't judge my pockets. We'll try horizontally first. Ooh. Ooh. It's pretty cute. This could be it, right? This sets a tone. Let's try the walls, right? Let's go like this. Let's do some wallpaper that would go well with this. This is too dark. This is giving me like, I don't know. This is giving me man cave vibes. I'm kind of going for like cozy fireside aesthetic. Hmm. Definitely not the inside. Maybe cityscape? Does does anyone know if cityscape, like it snows in, in cityscape? I don't know. Or we could do, I think the butterflies are like too much too. Hmm. Man, not stormy night wall either. I think I really want to move my kitchen to this room. Is that crazy? Let's try this one. Too dark. It's still too like grunge. That's not it either. Y'all, I'm so picky. I might end up doing the same wallpaper that I did already. Ah! Alright, let's go. The cityscape is beautiful, so someone on the stream. Welcome to the other person that's here. Oh my gosh, did you see that? My controller has been drifting! Oh, I'm frustrated. But we're gonna keep living. I think you're right, cityscape might be the wave. Blair. This is my kitchen, though. Do you see how much of, like, a clutter baby I am? Like, what is happening here? It's just too much. So, I'm thinking about moving these cafe walls into that room. But Blair's here for cityscape, so I don't want to take that away from her. I am, I think, going to move some of my kitchen items into this main room and then have this be a cool chill out area, like a little boba cafe situation. That could be cute. Um, hmm. Is there anything that I can take out of this room and move to the other room and feel happy about is the question. I don't think so. It's just so nice and neat and tight. Guys. Okay, maybe that clock, but mm -mm. I don't know. I'm thinking about moving it. I just want a bigger kitchen. Who doesn't want a bigger kitchen? Welcome everyone to the stream on Instagram. How y'all doing? I hope you can see the vibes that I'm trying to give off. Let's go with the cityscape. Let's just start there, you know, as a base. I think that's a reasonable starting point. I do live in a city. So why not have a city view that I always wanted? Bam. Here we go. We out here. We're committing. Okay. Let's see what other furniture I have. We're going to work with what we got, hopefully. 
Now we have this brown couch or double sofa. I feel like that might be something. I feel like the black rattan armchair could be something. If you see something, just let me know. Mm, not the antique wardrobe. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This would be a good idea because I still want like a kitchen area. So why not have an island and like make that come true? And the red fridge isn't the best choice, but that might be something to explore. The waste bin. We gotta have a plant in there, you know. Greenery is something that is quality decor. I am going to maybe... Oh, my friend O'Reilly is playing right now. What a clinky dink. Okay, we're going to look at the miscellaneous things. We got some lamps. We got a TV. I did like having the TV on the wall, but I guess that wouldn't make any sense if my, my, like, my wall is all windows. Not too sure. I definitely want to put the switch there. And... Mm. I do like the cherry blossoms. I love the pine bonsai. We're going to keep that. We're going to maybe not keep this right now. Definitely a box of tissues. You know, make it look lived in. Mm. And I want a section with the photos of my cow villagers. I still need to get tippers, but I want to make like a little wall. So this is what we got so far. Not a lot, I know, but hey, we're gonna do a bunch of rooms today. We're gonna do my bedroom, my main room. You might get weird in the basement. Okay, not wrong. But you know, something more fun for the basement. Oh, goodness me. Okay, so this side's the entrance. So we walk in, we see this gorgeous view. And then maybe we'll split the room as such. Over here will be the living area. So we'll maybe block off this corridor right here with the couch. Maybe put another chair somewhere over here. The TV will go this way where it switches. The plant might live here. The waste bin is obviously near the island because you've got to put your trash away maybe flip Ooh. i don't need to flip that flip the island this way so you'd walk around and like chef up over here maybe we'll put like another like counter right here you know let's look at the rugs sahara has been generous about the rugs lately Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I do love the moon rug. I thought I had the turkey day rug. I kind of wanted to see what that looked like. If you are just joining on the Instagram live, thank you for watching. You can check me out on Twitch at Boba Coast. Link is in my bio, I'm pretty sure. And I am recording this video so hopefully I can get it onto YouTube um, if you follow my YouTube channel let's see I'm just picking out a rug right now I'm redesigning my home I think I deserve the finer things and a little bit more of an update right don't we all this is the turkey day rug oh my god it's so cute Oh my god, you guys, look at the little leaves. Oh, I love it. Well, oh, I, I might have to keep it. We'll do this, and then we'll make like this, like half of maybe right here. How does, how does that look? 
We're getting somewhere, right? It, it could be a thing. This is probably going to go on another, like, table type situation. I'm really loving this rug, you guys. And I thought I had, like, a fireplace. Let's really do the TV. Wall mounted. Do some wall stuff. To the window. To the wall. Okay. Let's see what other wall stuff I have. I have clocks. I don't really think that would fit on the wall. I think I'm going to keep it pretty clean and clear. But I do like plants. And... Maybe not the tapestry. I do want to place her my keys by the door. We gotta... We gotta keep our keys. And maybe not any of these plants. I do like that one. I love the succulent plants. Mm. I can hear the bell at residence services telling me it is 8 p.m. We are in the thick of this design. I might have to order some things and make this like a two-part situation. Oh, we're going to use this, the turkey day hearth. Obviously. Turkey day hearth. And then we can put the hearth. Do people put hearths right under their TVs? But let me know. Shout out to Lulu Lemon Tree. Welcome to the stream. We're doing some interior design. We're getting our HGTV on in this bench. Okay, we obviously have to align the TV a little better. Do, do, do. Bam. Wait, maybe a little higher. Bam. Okay. What feelings is this evoking in your heart, everyone? Does it say she's like a baddie that's lived has her life together. It looks cozy. Thank you. These are the vibes we're going for. We're going for cozy, cozy apartment. Ooh, thanks for joining us. Enjoy your meal. Blair Crossing. Love you. If you were just joining us on Instagram, I am on Twitch at Boba Coast. Come say hi. It's some people are saying it looks cozy. I'm really loving it as well. What did I do with the oh? We gotta put the switch up there on the hearth, right? Maybe we'll put this plant, or do you think that gets in the way of the TV a little bit? Just a little bit, but you know, we're gonna leave it there. We are going to leave it there. Just for now. Switching, putting the keys up on the wall. You know how we do. I might just change the color of that later to a different wood, but I think we're getting somewhere. Let's put my little angel in there so she can get a feel for things. I come in, I drop off my keys at the, after a long day in the woods, collecting acorns and pine cones. I walk in, I, I sit on my lovely sofa and watch the fire. But then I get bored and I wanna put it out. Oh, I can't turn on the TV from here. Hmm. I mean, I guess that's not that big of a deal. I just want the illusion that, you know, I watch TV. Over here, we can cook a little mini meal. You know, we got a, we got a little heat stove. I can, I can chef up some snacks. I think I want to put something over here. I don't know. Let's see if there's something we can take from my room. Because my room also kind of needs a makeover. So we're going to clear that out too. And then, you know, we can... Because see, look at this. 
there's a lot going on here. I know. I know. It is very bright. I got posters all over the walls. I don't know. It just isn't concise to me. Um, and yeah, I want to do better. So we're going to be better. Let's clear it out. You know how it is. Sorry, shell bed. I might have to pick something less, like, obnoxious. Cleaning out everything. There is no object permanence. Boom. Boom. Oh, I love this little corner that I made for my tub, though. We might have to redo that. And the walls. As you see, I have posters of my cows that I love very, very much. We're going to keep them up. We're going to check out the walls and the floors. I think our girl, Blair, had a really great idea going on with that. The walls and the floor set the vibe. The vibe right now says, like, fairy room, like fairy core or something. We aren't, we aren't doing it. Oh, it says I'm dropping a lot of frames here. How do I fix that? Oh, I don't know. I'm not even doing that much. It's fine. Welcome to all four people in the chat. Can I see names? I think I can. It says users in the chat. It is me, Boba Coast, aka Lil Boba. C. Blair, Lulu Lemon Tree, and Star. Star. I don't even know. Start is? Star Ice One? Thanks for watching. Let me know what walls and flooring we should do in the bedroom. I feel like it can be it can be cozier. I feel like we can do a darker color. Okay, thanks for letting me know. They sent the thing that were overlapping to my storage. We have a kisses wall. I do love the wedding wall so. Just like so gorgeous. I would love I I honestly think this might be my room's wall. Or my bedroom. Do I have a different color of this wall as well. I have white, like, uh, oh, here's brown. Wonderful. Okay, and now we're going to do the floors. Let's take a look at it while we do it. I do like these floors. It's like geometric tile vibes. Maybe we'll do a brick. How does that feel in everyone's palette? Maybe we'll do not the sumo ring. Oh, I have so many like wacky ones. I don't really have any basic flooring. Maybe the white mosaic tile. Is that too bright? White honeycomb. A little better patchwork tile. That's pretty nice too. Slate flooring, white brick, light wood. Just trying stuff out, you know. Maybe this. It's a vibe. I can work with it. Ooh. Oh, I didn't mean to exit out. Let's get some stuff on the walls. Now for my room, I think I definitely want these plants still. I don't want the cobwebs. Do I need banners? I don't think I'm going to put my posters back up, I'm afraid. Mia Crossing, thanks for joining us. Never made it to your streams before, different time zones. Oh, alas. Well, I am recording this show and hopefully, um, this stream rather, and hopefully I'll put it up on my YouTube if it does. 
you know, record properly. Um, and it should be on my Twitch, hopefully, if I record this too. Um, thank you for following me on my Instagram. Friends, if you don't know, on my Instagram at Boba Coast, I do a lot of, um, I do contests when I hit a certain amount of followers. I'm working on my next one. Uh, before, I did some boba lip glosses. I'm hoping to give away another boba-related item to my followers once I hit um, 600. I think that's my next um, mark point. So thanks for joining us. I'm so glad you're joining us from a different time zone. I'm also live on Instagram right now at Boba Coast, so you can check that out if you'd like. Uh, I'm just redesigning my home. You know, I, I felt like I needed a change and to rearrange the furniture a lot for unnecessary reasons. And it feels like I might need a bed that's in my basement. Let's see if you can guess what type of bed it is. But I think I'm, I'm ready for that change. I do love the seashell bed, but it's a little obnoxious and like hard to design around without it being like mermaid, you know, so. There it is. It's the Luna bed. Down here is like kind of a hodgepodge. I, I don't know what's happening down here. Uh, how is my day going? Asked Mia the Crossing. My day is good. I had a Zoom class. I am an assistant teacher, so that was really interesting. A kid wore a marshmallow mask to math day and it made my day. It was super precious. It was this Halloween costume. Uh, and one of the other girls in the class was not having it. She was like, take that off, Jason. And it's like, girl, you know, just let him live. Don't, you're obviously like distracted by it and I get it, but it is so entertaining for me. And I'm what matters. Okay. So obviously we're going to have a little bedroom area. You know what? I like this being right in the middle here. We're going to have a bedroom area. We're going to have a get ready dress up area. Other than that, I have my Zoom. I watched a really cute movie on Disney Plus called Godmother. Would recommend. 10 out of 10. It was precious. It was heartwarming. It was funny. The costumes were insane. Um, and yeah, it was a great story concept. So that put me in a good mood. And now I'm here. After setting up my stream for what seems like a million trillion years, I finally got it working. And I'm recording, and people came and said hello, you know. <laughs> Never want to leave my house again. I teach music. I feel the exact same way. I could do remote learning for as long as they please. I don't want to be in a classroom. I don't want to be sneezed on. I don't want to be touched. I don't want my hair being pulled. I don't want the interactions with my boss or the other teachers that, you know, I don't want to have interactions with parents that I don't need to, you know? So I feel you on that, Nia. Yeah, it was a good day. So we're gonna have a bed area with a little chill out bed area. And over here, we're going to make it like a little in-room bath like I had last time, but like make it look classy and make sense. So here we go. We're going back, and I'm probably going to put a bunch of the things that I took out back into the room. But let's see. Let's try the antique wardrobe. We'll give that a try. Oh, duh. <laughs> Okay. Hmm. Maybe some gold accents? I am a Cancer rising, so maybe we'll put that in there. I'll give myself the finer things that I deserve. I do love this mermaid vanity, but I think I'm going to have to go with rattan. Because I do have the mermaid vanity in front of my ables, so you can like customize your whole fit from head to toe. It's like mermaid themed on the beach over there. Maybe we'll check it out later. 
you this sexy clawfoot tub, obviously. Once again, who doesn't love plants? Maybe we'll do this in the yucca. The waste bin. Hmm. What else do I want in my room? I have like so many pumpkin items. I'm so glad that they extended the storage of it all. It really makes me happy. Let's check how the Instagram is going. Hey y'all. I got a wave. I don't know who's here and like who isn't, but a lot of people tuned in. Thanks for tuning in. You're so sweet. So sweet. This Animal Crossing. Whoa! Ah! The, the community is so kind. It's like so nice to see familiar like names and stuff from my Instagram. Checking in on my home decor. Alright, let's get maybe some incense. You know, we gotta sage the room and things. I just heard like a weird room. A terrarium for sure. Maybe we'll do the fortune telling set up here instead of downstairs. You know, that's like a little bit more of an intimate setting type thing. I do love the swords, but I don't think those are gonna stay. Maybe I'll gift them. Oh, pardon me. Maybe I'll gift them to one of my villagers. I'm just getting ready for bed, so I won't be chatting so much. That's okay. Thanks. Thanks. You think my room looks cute. I appreciate it. I'm trying really hard. I just want, I'm manifesting my dreams, you know, through this game. Like, it's not just a game, you know what I mean? Like, I am manifesting this room. Same energy. Look. Bop. I didn't even mean to pick up both of those things, but it just looks so good together, doesn't it? Okay. We're gonna put the yucca plant over here. Maybe take this off the wall. I gotta take down the posters too. They just don't work here. We're gonna put this over here. The little waste basket. Oop. Put this over here. Flip it around. Definitely think that this terrarium thing should go somewhere over here. And then this could be like I could set up a little reading area right here. Let's double check my pockets. There it is. The antique wardrobe. Whoa. We're just going to turn it over. Oh. Okay, we're just going to turn it like this and then create the divides of the rooms like so. I think that's cute, right? This is a bop. What else is in my pockets that I put in here accidentally? The pop-up book. That's something brand new. This drying rack. And storage. And storage. And storage. Do, do, do. Let's go back into the design room. Maybe flip this around because, like, I wouldn't get dressed in the middle of the hallway. I'd get dressed over here. Let's pick out some rugs. We need a bedroom rug. And we need the rug that goes under the bathtub or, like, right next to the bathtub. Maybe this simple green bath mat. Ooh, no, the ivory. Mm, I mean, or the wooden deck. Ooh, that's not too bad. Maybe in white? I got too many things going on. Okay. Let's move this over here like this. Bam. Can I put... 
I like it. I do. Maybe we can move this like that. That way you're like, okay, this is this side of the home, you know. And then is there another one that I have? Okay, what if we did this? This magic circle rug can go into this corner with the set, right? Maybe like right here. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just spitballing. I got a lot of options for rugs, and I do love purple. If you're just joining us on Instagram, I am streaming on Twitch at Boba Coast. Thanks for tuning in. I did see one person popped in, but I don't know who it is. It's a mystery to me. Not the green. Maybe the small ivory round. That could be nice. Purple shag. Purple Persian. White medium. Okay. I think this I think we're getting somewhere. We're going to put this plush rug over here. Actually, no. We're going to move this over. We're going to put the plush rug on this side. Ooh, it already... Look at that. It already snapped exactly where it needed to be. I love it. And then we'll just put the plant over here. And then look, I would get out the, the tub. I would walk, you know, fix my hair, get my edges right. Then I go over here on this fuzzy rug where my feet are all warm and then I go and change my outfit. I'm here for it. Maybe we'll put this up here even. I like always forget you can put stuff on top of there. You know, why not? For now, let's go to the clothes. A tip that I saw is that putting clothes and hanging clothes on your wall makes your room look a little bit more realistic and lived in. I think I have like a robe or something somewhere. Hmm. I thought I did. Do I have slippers? Oh, there we go. Maybe we'll do the the Dodo Airline slippers. Yep. I think those are the only pair of slippers that I own. I buy very practical, oh, I have boss slippers, whatever. I pretty much have, like, practical shoes. Now, if you could put those cute little lug slides in here, I have two pairs of those, I would definitely love to see those in Animal Crossing. So if anyone is listening, it's got the connect. I have house slippers. I'll just do those. And I thought I had a robe, but I guess not. I'm going to double check one more time. Go a little bit slower. I'm always fresh and past stuff. That's why I like streaming. It gives me a chance to slow down and appreciate the game and the looks I'm trying to serve. It seems as though I don't have a robe, even though my villagers tend to either give me athletic wear or bath robes. So this is a turn of events. That's okay though. We're gonna put the slippers. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. Closer to the tub, close to the tub as I can. I think it looks cute. Hmm. I wish I could fit another rug in here. But I don't really know what it would be. Because it wouldn't be red. Um, maybe a bath mat. Hmm. 
orange rug, yellow small, white message, at shawl rug, the silk rug, one of those. Do we have any animals I can put in here? Maybe the goldfish? Right by the water? It's kind of a look, I'm not mad. I'm into it. Is there anything else on the walls that I can put that seems satisfactory? At the moment, no. The back of the furniture. Maybe a console table. And, or maybe the low retainer. Oh, maybe this. I have brown rattan. Oh, it doesn't matter. The Happy Home Academy can tell me how to live my life. Maybe a floor lamp. We got room for, we got floor space for it. Why not? I gotta sell some of this stuff I'm not using. Other than that, let's see. Maybe we'll put the console table right here. And then we put the floor lamp right here. And then on the other side, I kind of want to put it. Maybe we'll put the console table over here. And then this is like the side table where I'm going to put the little champagne flute that we're going to get soon. For New Year's. And then I guess we'll put the console table for here right now. I think it looks super cute. You guys. I'm really into it. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna do a little altar situation with this rattan thing. Gonna put this, gonna go like this. And then this breaks up like another part of the room. You see what I'm going for? And then I think I have pillows. Oops. Yes, I customized these Zen cushions with this cute little striped pattern. Just put those in the corner. You know. And I think I just need like a different chair. I should keep That divides up the room a little bit more. Maybe maybe like that. And I feel like I can craft like I I wanna craft some things that are more seasonal to put up here as well. So we might have to do a little crafting spree based on, you know, the items that I have available in my pockets and such. Ooh, yes. And the Aquarius urn. I forgot about that. How could I forget about the Aquarius urn? It's going right near the tub. Obviously. Hmm, let's see. Maybe we'll put this here, and then we'll put the urn here. And this right here. And maybe the reverse. I wish I could put the urn on top of that table, but it won't let me. Maybe we'll put it in this corner. Mm, it kind of makes sense to me.
anything else that I want to put up here? I know I keep scrolling through everything, but sometimes I just get bright ideas. Okay, we can definitely customize the cushion, maybe, to be something that matches the room a little more. Let me dip into my pockets. Ooh, I forgot about the miscellaneous items. You guys, I'm always forgetting how many items I truly have. It's honestly every time I forget. <laughs> and we just got more storage. Like, I should truly know better how many items I have. Just looking around for inspo. Okay, I love music. So maybe I'll just move my record player up here as well. Oh, and the candles. Alright, I'm going back in. I think I have more of an idea. This is going to be really cute. If anyone watching, hi, welcome to the stream. I'm streaming on a uh, on Twitch at Boba Coast, if you're live on my Instagram watching with me, I'm just doing some home design. Uh, would love some input advice, you know, any design tips. We're trying to be HGTV up in here, you know, a love it or list it situation. I, I can't think of any other shows. But I'm going to customize it something. The phonograph, the record box, and the tray blossom. Okay. The candles go near the back because we bougie. This little guy can't go on top of this, but it can go on top of here. I do want a place for like my records and stuff, so. I just might make this the music, the music corner. Maybe we'll go like that. And yeah. I think this is a great start. Let's let's put on some music. Let's get the vibes right. What do I want to hear when I walk into this room? I do love KK Groove. Alright, I'm going to take this. I'm going to get changed. Let's do one of my custom looks. And the bottom. It's supposed to rain tomorrow where I am, so we're just going to do the rain pants. And the shoes, since Galavar, actually I might wear these. I think that's nice. And a different bag, the acorn, obviously. I haven't tried hats with my braids yet. Oh my god, I'm so cute! Stop! I love the acorn hat! And the beret looks really cute with the braids, too. But I also love this dandy hat. I wore a lot of these when I was in my middle school days. IRL. And I also like the shallow knit caps. You know, a little more toasty. This is pretty nice, too. Should we do the, the plaid hat and change the whole fit? Now I'm just getting inspired in a different way. Um, hmm. I think we're going to stick with this hat. 
And maybe the do-rag, because I'm working indoors. Makes sense to me. Also, I got new glasses. An update on me personally. I got these glasses. They have blue, um, blue, blue screen things, you know, like, so I look at a lot of screens now. I'm always on my phone and my laptop for work, so it's supposed to help with, like, screen viewing and blue light protecting my eyes or something. I don't know. So I'm going to wear these glasses because they're my favorite. Mm, yeah, in that color. Yep. Oh, so cute. Thanks to Naturally Melly Marie for tuning in on my Instagram. Once again, I am live on Twitch. We are going to take a pause on my bedroom. I think it, it's made a lot of progress from what it once was. It seems more concise. It actually seems like a room, you know. Let's check out the kitchen. Or actually, let's check out the bathroom. I'm pretty proud of my bathroom. Not to brag. But I'm pretty proud of my bathroom. I think it's pretty cute. Look. Look how cute. Oh, there's that other towel robe. I'm going to take this. Oh, I didn't mean to take that. There we go. We're going to take some things out of this room. There is a lot going on, and I respect it, you know. I just want to make sure that it shines. So we're going to just scoop this over. Maybe even scoop this deeper into the corner. Um, everything on the walls are staying, to be honest. I think it just looks good. Yeah, I'm super proud of my bathroom. I don't think I'd change a thing besides maybe a different speaker. Maybe moving this closer to the bath. Does that make sense to me? Moving this deeper into the cut. Moving. It's so hard to put like speakers and make it look like it makes sense in the room, I feel. But yeah, I'm pretty proud of my bathroom. I'm not gonna change that much. We'll check out this other room. I'll show you my crafting room as I see what other items I can craft to add to my decor. Over here is what I call the crafting forest. There's a lot happening in here, but I do a lot of sewing and watercolor painting and like projects um, in real life. So I wanted a room that kind of fits my DIY upcycle vibes, but I wanted to make it fun. So I made it like an outdoor sea area. Let's see if there's anything I can craft right now that I could add into my living room. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Hmm. I do love the guitar. And I have a ukulele. Mm -hmm. Maybe this iron would work. This iron work table. I feel like that might fit in with the cityscape. Precious, precious. Let's see what else we can make. Um, I can also make maybe like another ironwood cart. Something to think about. It's not really seasonal. Oh, I can make another turkey day casserole thing. Those are so cute. Oh, I love the turkey day items. Okay, I'm just going to make one more. I think that's all I can make right now. 
But I like this room. It feels like everything is like to the walls though, you know, so there's room for improvement for this room, for sure. Oof, these headphones are hurting my head a little bit. Okay. So we got the ironwork table and we got the turkey day casserole because I'm trying to make this feel like a kitchen. And what better way to have it feel like a kitchen than use this cute new item that we have. All of the food and kitchen items I am obsessed with. I'm going to put it right there. And then I thought we could maybe put this table here and make like another like appliance, like milk or something. I, uh, I need to get a side table for right here for these tissues. Because your girl's nose be runny. No COVID or nothing. Maybe a table setting? Seems a little too formal for like a casual dining space. Melly Crossing, hi, thanks for joining us. I really love your house decor. I've never seen any others like it. Oh, thank you. Room for yoga though, true, true. I, I could have a little workout space. I do, I am certified in um, bar classes, like ballet bar workouts. So it is something that I like to do. And I feel like my villager deserves that. I'm just looking for a table. I think I used all the tables. I can't know. Oh, right. We're in miscellaneous items. We're looking for stuff to go on this thing. Maybe not a knife rack, but maybe this thing. We'd love a cutting board. Maybe a microwave. Mm -hmm. Or actually, let's do the cozy tea. The cozy tea is classy. So, we're going to put the cozy tea over here that and then we're going to put the cutting board right here uh i think i can change the color of the wood how you doing melly crossing thanks for tuning in i don't know if anyone is still watching on my instagram but i just wanted to make sure everyone knew that i was streaming Hmm, I'm trying, let's, let's, let's maybe go out into the world and get some more materials to decorate with, and then we'll go from there. How does that sound? Because also, your girl needs some advice when it comes to um, going back to a five-star island. Because I'm at a four-star island, and these cute little little lily of the valleys stopped growing on my island, and I really want more. But I'm still at a four-star item, and it's because apparently I have too many items, but I don't know what Isabel's talking about. It sounds like she's a hater. Oh, I got mail. Oh, it's from Anna. Melly's playing Pokemon right now. Sounds fun. Ooh, a street organ. Shout out to Anna, my work buddy. She's a science teacher. And and that's my, my boyfriend's character. He doesn't play Animal Crossing, but he, he has mail, and I, I don't play as him as often. Only if I, like, need to buy extra paintings and things. But, yeah, I understand that I have a lot of items. Like, and I have so many DIYs. If you need DIYs, please let me know. I need to get rid of these DIYs. I'm about to just sell them all. That's how frustrated I am, but I know that there are new players that definitely need DIYs out there. So let me know. We're just going around looking for some items that can go in my home. Oh. Looks like my girl Naomi's thinking about something. Oh, she can't find her makeup bag. Oh, I'm going to look for it while I look for stuff. And look, we're both wearing Boba Coast Couture. Look at her cute little sweatshirt. I made that. It's 
the designer boba because she is a bougie broad. Let's see if we can find her little pouch while I'm out and about like this. This is Tia's house. It's a little cafe. Oop. This is the Abel's by the shore. I'm going for mermaid beach vibes over by them because they deserve it. I added these lights. This was something that like popped into my head. I'm like, oh my god, why didn't I think of this? They're like little street lights for the duck. Just, I amaze myself sometimes. It took me like so long to think about that. We got a sled, you know, we're ready for the holidays. Yada yada. This is my man's house. He likes the mushroom items. So I, I put them outside for him. We got some Halloween stuff still out. We aren't going to talk about it. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not really seeing anything that's like calling out. Oh look, there's Sammy's thing. That's calling out. Okay, we gotta get that back to Naomi. Don't let me forget y'all. Okay, I'm gonna browse up here. There's not much that I'd want to see in my house to be honest. I just, I'm so happy with my decor outside. Maybe let's check over in this area. Maybe this this thing? A little candle action. And then uh, I like how it looks back there. Let's check down here. I might have to order some things, to be honest, you guys. Go into my theater camp area. Oh, there's a balloon. It's probably just money, though. It's probably going to fall into the water. i got to go this way anyway. Here's Naomi. Oh, she's talking to Norma. I changed her catchphrase to, oh me, oh my, because I just thought it would be cute. A bop is also a catchphrase that's been going on, going around a lot. Your outfit looks great, Norma. You angel. Cherish those clothes. Uh -huh. Stylish ensemble such as yours mustn't be hidden away. I agree. I agree. Why hide it? Share it with the world. Oh, we still need to give this. <laughs> Naomi. <laughs> I forgot. You dropped this. Here you go. You found your makeup bag. Easy peasy. Oh my god, it's a snowflake sweater. I'm gonna put it on right now. Oh, it's so cute. Ready for Christmas. What a wholesome angel. Oh, there's that balloon. I forgot that too. I'm all over the place, y'all. It's probably just money. A pilot's hat. Not bad. And then that's the street organ from my friend. I think I will put that over here for now. Let's get a closer look of it, shall we? It looks like a bunch of animals. Oop. 
but it is very Christmassy. Over here, I'm trying to do like an outdoor kitchen vibe. Norma is precious. Hi, Pixie Butter, if you're just joining, I'm streaming on Twitch right now. I don't know if you're on Twitch right now, girl, but mad props to you. She's on Instagram, Pixie Butter, on my Instagram live. She's an angel, meme queen, if you will. TikTok temptress, if you will. But yeah, I'm just looking for more stuff to put inside my house. And I'm kind of having a hard time. Oh, wait, you guys, I gotta show you this other area I've been doing. I agree, Norma is really precious. This little area is like a little chill lunch area for my girl Isabel, you know what I'm saying? I, I just imagine her coming out and this is like her spot. Like no one takes her spot on this bench. And she has her little snacks and she's right near the juice drink thing if she wants to get her little soda or her water. I can't find anything else to put in the doors. Let's do some shopping. Let's get some money and do some shopping at the kiosk. Oh, well, my battery is dying on my phone, so I'm going to go plug it up. But if you watch this live on my Instagram, thank you for watching. This has been Boba Coast. Shout out to everybody on the Twitch chat that stopped by as well. Um, I think I'm going to be streaming Animal Crossing for like maybe like another hour or so. And then I'm going to switch to Spell Break because I do have some quests that I want to accomplish today. Um, so I'm going to end my stream on Instagram. Don't worry, people on Twitch. I'm just ending my Instagram stream. Say hello. Um, thanks for watching. Bye. Posting my live, and now we're back. I'm gonna take out some cash because I don't have a lot of cash on me. I'm gonna take out like a cool ten thousand. See how we do. At the store, you can only buy three things a day, right? So, I gotta really make it count. I'm not even gonna use the kiosk. I'm gonna use my phone, even though I'm right near the kiosk. Typical me. Let's see what they're trying to sell to me today. I'm specialty items. Nothing interesting. Ooh! Guys, the Aurora Wall! Why didn't you say anything? And I think I already have a midwinter sweater, but this Aurora wall, this Aurora wall is about to be everything. I might have to rethink my whole home decor seeing that. Well, that was my first thing. Let's check out my catalog. Look at the furniture. Is there anything else that I'd want in my home? I'd love the artisanal bug cage. I guess I gotta get another one of the bug off. Mm. Oh, wait. There we go. That simple switch. Filtering what's for sale and what's not for sale is saving me so much time. And I'm here for it. The cute sets are cute, but like not truly for me. Ooh. Hmm. Maybe a fridge. I don't have enough money for this fridge, but I should buy a fridge, right? Or wait, they have a mini fridge. 
maybe a mini fridge for the living room, and then we still have the kitchen that has like a fridge fridge. Dream board. We got the kids' tent in three different colors. Shout out to my friends on my Discord that assisted me. A low screen. What do you guys use this for? I have no idea what to use that for. Would that be helpful in my room design? Please let me know. I want to use it. It's cute and all. I just don't know how. There's the mini fridge. It's not in any colors I like want in my living room now. But it seems like a compromise I'm going to have to make. Ugh, I love the pinball machine. Hmm. Maybe a yeah, no. Maybe not the surfing cart. Study chair. <clears throat> I'm really contemplating my life right now. We do have a vacuum that I could put out that might be cute. We'll do one Zen cushion. Um, let's look at the miscellaneous. Why not? Mm, I think that's it. So we'll be ordering those items and putting them in it later. Um, I don't really know what other home design things I can do. I feel like I ran out of ideas with kind of the items that I have. Um, so we're gonna scoot on over this way. Oh, Nooks is still open. I did not know that. I might need some more customized uh, boxes. Joint effort, Commander Root, Melee Crossing, and Mia Crossing. Thank you so much for sticking around with me. Oh my god, look at the little snowman up there. I didn't know there was a snowman up there. I've just been hustling and bustling and missing the little things. We're going to get some customization kits. We're going to get a dumb amount. Yeah. There's not really anything in here that I want either, but that's okay. I mean, I've been streaming for like an hour and 15. I think that's like pretty good for like a home decor stream, right? How long are the streams you usually watch? Let me, let me get a, a gauged amount. Let's customize this cushion. Yeah, but we're not going to use any of those. Let's see what patterns the Ables have given us. Maybe I can use one of those basic ones because it is the holidays. Maybe we'll go for something like this or like one of these. Not retro. Natural. Playful. I'm not seeing what they like. This donut one seems brand new. I really don't recall seeing that, but okay. Or maybe we should do the cow print. I love a cow print. Oh, I'm a strawberry cow. We used to stream around two hours. Wow. If I try for around three or four, it's a lot easier when lots are watching. I believe it. 
maybe that's why I'm feeling a little bit of the fatigue. I mean, I love you guys. I love that you're sticking around and listening to me blab. I feel supported and cared for. But I also just want to, like, shake up my gains. But I'm going to power through. That was <laughs> six. Yeah, yeah. I feel that. Relatable content. I might use this. The Christmas blanket. That's what I've been using for some of my picnic blankets outside. I feel like I accomplished a lot today, friends. I really do. Oh, we can check out this area too. This is like the little orange hangout area. It's like a little park. Just the orange park. I'm pretty proud of it. I used to have a lot of flowers here, if like people don't remember. And I kind of cleared those away because I want the snow to shine this winter, you know? I'm also trying to put a little like green house right here. How do y'all do that? I like saw it and I was like, I should try. So this is me trying, but I, it's kind of a project that went away to the wayside. Up over here is the diner. And then we have like another little boba coffee area. I don't know what's going on here. We'll just move past that together. This is like the apple orchard area. Thought I'd put that near Gruff. More flowers out of control near my diner, obviously. I don't hang up here much. And my villagers, I don't see my villagers hanging up, hanging out over there. So I don't really know what to do with that information, but. Matches the autumn vibe. Oh, thank you. I'm trying. Trying to give it my all out here. It brings me joy. Over here is Stitch's house. This is where I use that blanket pattern again. And all the mom cushions, because he's like all patched up. I think it's really cute. He's got a little area to himself. And I think we're going to put this cushion in the room. And then I think that'll be it for Animal Crossing for today, honestly. If you want to stick around, I am going to end this stream and then restart another stream for Spellbreak. Um, if you want to check that out, Spellbreak is a free game on the Nintendo Switch. That is the... Um, it's like kind of like... How do I explain it? It's like Fortnite, but with magic, so I don't really play a lot of games with guns, um, but I do love, like, Harry Potter type energy, you know what I mean? So I play a lot of Spellbreak. I'm a really big fan of the gameplay, of, like, the lore and the stories behind it, um, and it's just really fun. I have a lot of fun playing, so I hope you'll stick around for that stream. Um, who is my favorite villager? I will show you. My favorite villager. How do I look at that? Oh, look at the map. My favorite villager is probably Tipper. It's between Tipper and Tia. Tia can rock any outfit I give her. Like any outfit I give this elephant, she slays it. Um. Then I would say Tipper because her eyelashes are are heartwarming. Like look at her little eyelashes. I just think they're super cute. Um, but I do love all my cow villagers. They're like definitely in the top for me. Um, 
Leonardo and Bianca are like my two tiger, like leopard villagers. I just thought they were great because they both have spots like boba. I have the cows because like it's all the different milk teas. So, you know, we got Naomi who's like probably like a coffee boba type person. We got Norma who probably has like strawberry or lychee or something cute like that. Um, and then we have Tipper that's probably like a classic oolong vibe. And Patty, who's like a little bit of chocolate, a little bit of orange, you know. Um, so, yeah, that's like kind of my theming around my island is um, boba tea. Um, so from my map, as you can see, like all of my patterns are very round and bubbly. Um, and I have a lot of boba themed uh like water fixtures so by Henry's house they, he lives by Boba Falls um, and then by my boyfriend's house Steve's he lives by Boba Pond so I kind of want to have that be another like theme that's around and about my island but I'm not sure how I also wanted um, like hopefully in the future for I wish I could like point to my map specifically so you guys can see. But near resident services, I wanted to cut down over to where the airport is maybe and make my island look like it has like a cup in the middle of the island. I don't know. You used to have Norma. Yes, I love Norma. I cannot let my cow villagers leave at all. If anyone's allowed to leave, it's probably Gruff. He's like, okay, he's a chill guy. Um, Gruff could go, Stitches could go, I'm thinking about doing a giveaway with Stitches when he asks to leave, Bianca, um, could maybe, she could maybe hang out and stay, Leo, I don't know, Henry, I love Henry, he has to stay, just makes me think of Princess and the Frog, he's so sophisticated, but yeah, Norma's really, really sweet, and I love Tipper, she's just, a sophisticated cow. I love my heifers. What can I say? Um, so... Um, let's put this candle thing up here, too. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I'd hope my map would look like that, but, you know, things always go to the wayside. And I've, I've tried to make it that way, and it never goes the way I really want it to. Um, but yeah, that was my, uh, Animal Crossing HGTV, you know, a home design spree. I really just wanted to refresh my room and have it look like somewhere I actually live. And I think I really accomplished that here. Um, over here we have this cute little bath area that I'm super proud of. Ooh, but I cannot reach the vanity because these slippers are in the way. Oh my god. Let's see if we can come up with a solution really quick before I switch over. Because I will be thinking about that five ever. Maybe we'll put this... Okay, this is what we're going to do. We're going to put the waste basket over here. We're going to put the this thing over here. We're going to put this over here. And then I'll be able to get some vanity. Um, it was so nice getting to know you two. Uh, please stick around um, for my Instagram uh, content at Boba Coast. Hopefully this video will be up on my YouTube channel. That is, I want to say that's also linked in my bio. But if not, and you want to check out my YouTube series, I do reviews, I do DIYs, I do painting, I do all the things that I love and care about, including Animal Crossing and Black Girl Magic. Um, you can check that out on my personal Instagram, at ohmyflood. I will drop it in the chat. I'm always looking for friends. If it'll let me. Oh, there we go. At oh my a flood. So that's my Instagram if you want to check out my YouTube. Um, my music, yes, I have music on Spotify and all platforms, I believe. Uh, I'm just a, 
the multifaceted uh, boba babe. So thanks for watching. I love you so much. I'm getting all